Okay. Oh. Merry Christmas, everybody. I got my Rudolph sweater. Look what I got. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> like this. Dun, 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 dun. And then. <laughs> oh, and then I have my little pouch. To get blitzed. Get blitzed. <laughs> And I got this. Yeah. So he can officially get blitzed. Yes. It's Christmas. <laughs> it's Christmas. It's Christmas. Merry Christmas, you guys. Merry Christmas. <sighs> we don't have, we don't do gifts. Well, we do, but um, the way we see it is that Sue is my, my only gift I really, really deserve. And that's all I need, you know, all year round. She's the best gift. And I remember her walking through the doors and that was my gift ever since then so nothing she gets me or anything that can ever match to just her to my wonderful self yes yeah. her beautiful self well we decided we were um not going to exchange gifts this year like um you know official gifts where you do that stuff um merry christmas babe yeah merry christmas honey we're just uh are feeling so thankful and blessed uh, for everything that we've been given, um, to have each other still here, we wake up, you know, still have each other. That that is the best gift we could have, and so we just uh, just celebrate. Just celebrating Christmas and being here and with our friends and family. Yeah, she was making cookies this morning. She had sugar powder all over. So she was my Christmas cookie. <laughs> I said, "Taste me, I'm delicious." <laughs> Like covered in powdered sugar yeah. for making. So I hope you guys are having a great cookies. Christmas, and I hope your kids woke up to a great surprise underneath the tree. It, I mean, I I can only imagine. You know, we can only imagine. But um, congratulations for all the things and people who have birthdays today. Oh my yeah. goodness! All Happy these birthday. like Christmas, holiday season birthdays and Christmas. Yeah. Um. Hope you got good celebrations for both. Yeah. Yeah, and then we had a good, we were on, uh, I was on Facebook this morning just checking, you know, saying hi and everything. And we had a pretty big surprise with our friends we've known for years. Yes, Rudy and Marissa. Yeah. Oh my gosh, they've been together for, I don't even know how many years, at least a at least dozen. A, <laughs> <laughs> they've been together for a long time um, and been through a lot of adventures uh, together. And this, a lot of trials, a lot of everything that life gives you. Yeah. Um, and man, I'm so excited for them. Yeah, me too. I'm really excited for them. They're just so. a great couple. Um, <laughs> so congratulations, Rudy and Congrats, Marissa. Congratulations, we Rudy and Marissa. love you guys so, yes. so much. Cheers to a long and happy life together. Yeah. May it be very blessed. So, oh, before we start on that, we also have what we found <laughs> is this. It's a uh, Bailey's Dutch, or is it Dutch chocolate? No, it's just chocolate. Belgium chocolate. And oh, it's, it's, it's freaking delicious. It is so, so you gotta shake it to make sure the chocolate's in there really good. And, you want some? Uh, oh, you're drinking no, tea. No, I'm drinking tea. <laughs> He's like, okay, what more. an amateur. I'm drinking coffee. Right. Look at that. He was Look prepared. At that. Beautiful chocolate. It's really good. Mm. In fact, yesterday when we went to um, uh, Messia to see the Illuminatias, they, they light them up every Christmas Eve. I made us some hot chocolate with a, a good shot of that in each of it. So That is some good was, um, Christmas cheer. So with coffee <laughs> or hot chocolate or just on its own, it's delicious. Oh, my goodness. That's all good. I'm not a big Bailey's fan by itself, but I'm a big chocolate fanatic. And... True you know, story. I don't just have one sweet tooth. No. I have a whole mouthful. <laughs> Even so, his toes, I yeah. think, are sweet. And so <laughs> I just love it. I love it. <laughs> so anyway, we oh, also man. want to talk about um, last weekend. <laughs> we had a great, great time uh, preparing for this. Um, we want to thank all our friends and, and that came to support us and help us out with this commercial that we put together. And we want to thank the man first is Jay, Jay Barth, who uh, gave us this opportunity to do this. And without him, this wouldn't have been possible. 
but without the friends that came over to help us, man, it was just. Yeah, they helped us create this whole, um, you know, a couple of months ago we had been talking about uh, what would our, you know, what kind of commercial, you know, if someday we make a commercial, you know, what would we want it to be? And Ray had this whole idea of a kind of like a dinner party scene um, or a cookout or, you know, just something like that with our friends and family. And so that's what we got to create uh, last week. And it was just perfect. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was, it was cool perfect. because our marinade is so unique. Um, you know, we didn't know where it was going to go. We really did not know. We just like, all right, it just started with one thing and then it just kept snowballing and snowballing. And it became its own cre uh, creation. Like, oh my God, what did we create? Because you can use it on anything that walks, crawls, flies, or swims. But the coolest thing is that you can use them in drinks big time and like dirty beer, Bloody Mary's, shrimp cocktails, whatever, whatever you can think about. We even had a friend, um, that made uh, cupcakes with our riptide. Mm -hmm. And we're like, what? So when that was she, with our green chili version. And when so when she brought it over <laughs> for us to sample, it was just like, wow. You know, it was just- I mean, we were kind of nervous at first because we didn't know what to expect. I mean, it had never occurred to us to try anything like that. Yeah, um, never. But she's such a talented baker. You know, she tasted it and was like, I can make something with this. And we're like, go for it and she did she knocked it out of the park with these amazing green chili yep. cupcakes <coughs> yep. Thai green chili so that was pretty amazing um but anyway back to the commercial so we got oh, a yeah. chance to do that <laughs> um that was most all day saturday and uh everything just went beautifully we all ate like crazy because oh, uh, yeah. of course we prepped all sorts of food we prepped drinks we were making you know, everybody was doing something and um, we cannot wait to see how it comes out. It'll be airing early next year. Yeah. Um, we want to thank the man, um, the one that started it all uh, for us. Like, did I just say that earlier or no, <laughs> just now? <laughs> well, our friend Jay gave us this incredible opportunity. Um, we're not sure whether we said anything or not because we tried to re do this earlier <laughs> and then we realized it wasn't um, recording when the phone then the camera shut off that <laughs> we just been talking but, hey. <laughs> for nothing but anyway so if we've thanked him twice that's fine because he deserves it jay gave us this incredible opportunity um got us connected with the right the right um people and that's how we got into this commercial and um it'll be you know, major networks, Discovery, HGTV, the Food Network, the Cooking Channel, all kind of the lifestyle type channels. Um, yeah. We'll have audio commercial on like just Spotify, like Odyssey, uh, pop up social media. So it's this whole huge package, and um, we couldn't be more thankful. We couldn't be more thankful. Yeah. Uh, so we this got our is... work cut out for us still, but that was um, last weekend. We right. were like slammed with that. That was part of what we made the brisket for. Um, and we've got to show you guys uh, our Riptide sliders as well. That'll be coming up soon. So we uh, want to thank everybody that showed up. Um, uh, Going to call out some names. Uh, let's see. Glenn and, Ro names. Glenn and Roseanne. <laughs> uh, Melanie, Daryl and Casey. Bobby and Bridget, uh, Scott and Beth, and Linda, and Linda, and Monique, Monique, um, Desiree and Sean, Emily, Emily, Aaliyah, Aaliyah. Vic, um, Vic, yeah, Vic, gosh, Daniel, Daniel, with his amazing furniture arranging skills, yeah, um, and it just it was if we miss somebody we don't mean to and also for the uh, videographer uh leo thank you for videographing this thing yeah. and uh hopefully we'll, we'll see it in um beginning of february because we were trying to get it in the middle of february so we can have it out there it's got to be out there soon but there's still a lot more work we need to do with it but yeah. the raw man, footage that, looked great so we're really excited yeah um that was our Christmas gift. You know, our gifts come like that. You know, we don't need to give gifts uh, to each other because our gifts come from friends and, 
and the support they give us and everything. And that's just, that's a whole total package of love right there. You know, it's just so beautiful when they do that. And uh, we support them for what, what they do and they support us. And that's mm -hmm. just such Those a- Those are the things that money can't buy. That's yeah. That's really precious. So, yeah. Um, yeah. We but um, we also did a video on the brisket and it's a 30 minute uh, video. That's uh, Sue preparing the brisket up to the next day and up to the third day. All right, so it just really it's a process, and but it's uh, it's like a step by step using our our. Did you use a green chili or did you? Use, uh, um, I used the heritage, and then when we were mixing it together, I think I added. I used a blend of the red and green. Okay, so it wasn't because it's all really complementary. Yeah, um, and so it was like we had some red red chili we had some green chili and then um and then i made a pineapple coleslaw so we could have um sliders yeah like the hawaiian rolls and so brisket we'll show you sliders. how to do those we'll sliders show you how to do that later. but the brisket is what you want to learn how to first do it first that's key and that's the brisket and the sliders are the coolest things for a super bowl sunday and i'm not kidding for any is, party for yeah for any party but for a super bowl sunday mm -hmm. you want got a bunch of people to feed and then if you feel like when you take out that brisket that you want to be stingy just buy some pizza <laughs> <laughs> let everybody you else taste it and realize how delicious it is it is <laughs> yeah. and like mm, yeah. maybe i don't want to share yeah <laughs> mm -hmm. so that was fun and uh like i said we couldn't be more thankful and we'll keep you guys up to date on that mm -hmm. and let you know when it rolls out and the video for the brisket's already on the riptide spice house yeah. uh youtube channel so you can check that out um click and subscribe, subscribe just... too click and subscribe oh, yeah like and subscribe like and subscribe um click click yeah click to like and subscribe so um yes yeah, so the brisket is already on there and we'll add the sliders on there soon yeah um you, are you gonna show them how to make the coleslaw you should that way they have it all i can yeah that way you guys have it all it'd be okay be perfect because that coleslaw is i have bomb. to make it again that coleslaw I didn't, is super good i didn't feel it's really easy um but that doesn't mean everybody knows how to do it so yeah yeah and so then we'll uh, well. what else are we doing Oh, then we were preparing for the, so, has, yeah, we had a show on, what was it, Friday? It was I don't even on, know what today is. Today is Christmas. Besides Christmas. It on, is Sunday? Oh, Saturday we did the show, so we prepared it on Friday all week. No, wait, today's Monday. Yeah, Monday. Oh, it's Monday. So, so, we, <laughs> so we showed it on Saturday. On Saturday. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so that was, um, should I describe, like, what they are? Yeah. Well, I'll post. I'll post some pictures. Some post pictures yeah, so while we're doing this too. Pictures. Um, they are um, stained glass windows that were found in a barn. Um, do, I, do I go through the whole story? No, uh, I'll just let briefly. So I I got permission to go photograph them, um, and uh, for those of you that don't know, I have a degree in fine arts um, photography. So part of what I part of what I did with that was just I wanted to create something that reflected how I felt when I saw them. So they are 11 feet tall. Uh, the prints are 11 feet tall. And um, so it's not easy to show them. You need a big space. Um, and thankfully, you know, I work at a great uh, real estate brokerage. Um, so shout out to Raul, my my uh, QB at Select Realty. The who, quarterback. That's what the yeah, QB he's means. Quarterback. Um, who gave me permission and the opportunity to just kind of take over the space. Um, me and my best friend Aaliyah, we've shown a lot of work together over the years. Um, and so we put together the show with um, a really beautiful piece of hers uh, and the angels. And we just did it for one evening only, three hours. So we did like several days of work just for this three hour show to set it up and everything. But it was amazing. Uh, yeah, a lot of, it's it very, amazing. it touches a lot of people's hearts and, 
and has a great story behind it as well. Maybe we'll do a video on that, you know, so she can explain everything about it and we'll have the, maybe we'll have to show some, uh, the angels behind you, her or something. We'll figure out something, we'll figure but out that'd something. be so, ooh, that would be so cool. It would be cool. So that way you guys can get a taste of it. And, uh, if you guys are ever, if we ever have another show, you know, come by, you know, and, and check it's it out. Impossible to, um, convey what it's like to stand in front of them as Let's opposed convey. to just like explain, okay. Um, okay. describe. It's hard to describe uh, how you, the experience of it, because you think, oh, it's just these big prints. And technically they are, but uh, they are so much more than that. So it's really special to see in person. Yeah, very cool. Yep. So that's what we've been like cra kind of crazy doing. And then we tore down, we finished tearing down yesterday. Yeah. Um, we've been making cookies. No, oh, not That's me. What we're She's gonna making be. cookies. I, I, I eat them. He's been quality control. <laughs> <laughs> I eat them. Like, oh, there's too many here. Yeah. Race quality control, <laughs> making sure that they're good, cooked correctly. Um, all, all of that. Yeah. All that hard work. Yeah. So we're going to be handing some of those out today. Yeah. I'd rather stay, I'd rather stay home. But, and eat all the cookies. <laughs> no, I'd just rather stay home. I know. But we got to go and deliver. <laughs> humbug. Mr. Grinch. Bah, humbug. <laughs> Mr. Anyway, Grinch. you guys have ourselves Mr. a Grinch. Merry Christmas. And uh, hopefully you'll have a better year. And the only way this, uh, this world's going to get better is uh, if we all give each other the peace. <laughs> Anyway, we love you guys. Happy New Year and happy holidays. Happy holidays. See you later. How do you say that in Hawaii? Uh, uh, Merry Christmas? Yeah, I forgot how to say that. Mele Kirikimaka. Mele Kirikimaka. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. All right, you guys. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. <laughs>